Austin Ramsey was one of the many attendees at the lecture held in the historic Levitt Auditorium. From a student's perspective, Austin believes that lectures like this are a great benefit to a small college town like Murray. It was, it was good. It was very informative. I think that that kind of lecture series, that kind of, um, that kind of information provided us at a small, time, small town campus is a wonderful opportunity for students because I know that when I chose to come to Murray State, there were certain things that I know a lot of students, I, 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 I felt it and I know a lot of students did, they felt like they were giving some things up. You know, we were giving things up like the availability of some restaurants 24-7 and things like that, simple things. But when, we're, when we have the availability of, of insider information, consultant information, that's so relevant because of the, uh, because of the election coming up this year, um, it makes us feel like we're more relevant, but it made, it made students feel like they had the inside, the foot in the door, they had the insider knowledge on, on what was going on in the rest of the nation, and it made Murray State feel more important, as it should. As a journalism student, Austin attended the lecture series to provide coverage for a class assignment. James Carville noted Austin's attire in a press conference prior to the lecture. My professor is also the advisor the, for the paper, and he knows that I have a far more bow ties than I need to have. And um, he said, "You don't, you, you know." When he was telling us what we need to wear for the lecture, he's like, "You know, just wear khakis and a nice shirt. There's no need to wear a tie." And I said, "Well, I'm going to wear a tie." And he said, "Oh, you're going to wear a bow tie, aren't you?" And I said, "No, I'm going to wear a bow tie and suspenders." And so it was kind of a, a running joke in the class. And when it came time to the night, I, I made sure I wore a bow tie and suspenders. So, and then I know that James Carville, uh, in, the, in a press conference prior to the, uh, to the actual lecture, he, I think he, he said I looked strapping, a strapping young gentleman or something like that. So just he, he noted my suspenders and bow tie.